Next up is Sam Smith from Sound Sphere. There's a lot of S's there in the United Kingdom. Hi, Sam. Hi, Tom. Hi, Mickey. So thinking back, it, actually, let's say we moving ahead after Bound for Glory. Let's imagine when you get past Mia Yim, which you will. Um, you. Exactly. So oh. last year, something very special happened for, for wrestling fans in general, not just Impact fans, which was you walking out, holding the Impact Knockouts title at the Royal Rumble. Now, as an Impact fan, I can't tell you how, how important that was. Um, amazing to see after after over 20 years it, it was just amazing to see that um so that's going down history straight away e- even if you do retire after this like that Thank you've you. got that forever however if you do get past me in when you get past me in is there any possibility of you doing that again because you've opened the door there yeah um and i'm very blessed and very fortunate and as a impact wrestling fan and as a wwe wrestling fan as a wrestling fan as a whole i know some people like to try to downplay um how impactful that was but we would you know it opened up the door for someone like cody rhodes to come back at wrestlemania you know and this was not something i know other companies have have done it and talked about it but wwe had never done that before you know, especially for the women. And I think the last time that a championship um, had been seen on their programming that was not their championship was what Dan the Beast Severn um, when yeah. he was like NWA champion or maybe Jeff Jarrett, uh, which was 20 years ago, but not this this era of, of wrestling. Um, and I felt like it was important to me uh, for, for many reasons to have that um, closure, I think because of the circumstances and I knew it wasn't a purposeful thing um, when I left and I was blessed to be able to be the knockouts world champion. And if I was going to go back to the rumble, I wanted to represent impact and I wanted to represent that championship with class. And um, because it is important, I think that the knockouts, I've always said it that the knockouts are the cream of the crop. And, and I feel like they're often um, because they've been doing so many amazing things for so long that people forget how awesome they are. And I thought that it was really special. And I thought it was really special that both companies allowed that moment to happen and it was beautiful and it was special. And for us, it hadn't been done before, you know, and um so regardless, that is a very, very special moment in wrestling history and my own history. And I was, you know, really grateful to be the one to be able to do it. So, yeah, I mean, who's to say, uh, you know, who's to a say? milestone moment it was a milestone yeah. moment. Uh, Sam, you. thank you for your question. We appreciate it.